Here at 3D Machines, we're expanding our services. We no longer only specialize in super fly and froggy fresh merchandise, or kickstands or decals. No, we're going beyond that. Now we are offering painting services. And trust me, you will not be disappointed. Call 1-800-333-3333. It appears Cole has some problems with his vehicle. Cole, you have some problems with your vehicle? That's an understatement. Yeah, I thought you were gonna go grab some tools so you can help me. <laughs> Cole, it's kind of ironic because today's like Memorial Day and like people passed away. Thank, I, thank you for your services. Thank you. And the, the current people that uh, serve our country, thank you very much. But uh, Cole was, I think, dude, one more drive and he would have joined some veterans. At least I wouldn't have to drive this car. <laughs> His ball joint, his nut on his ball joint was like completely loose, completely loose. It was on what, probably a thread or two? Yep. So Don was thinking today, man, I don't have anything good to put on YouTube. <laughs> so I was in my call over with this piece of car. <laughs> I'm sure we could find some entertainment. I think people are more into like the brotherly love than the, the whole fixing the car thing. Oh yeah? Cole, your whip is putting us behind schedule for the barbecue though, buddy. Wouldn't be the first time. <laughs> They're right there. Next time use those, because look, look at your hands. What do you mean? <laughs> That's why I hate working on cars. Cars are the best, buddy. It. Cars are the best. See, when you work on this thing, you don't get that Yeah, see, you got room to work. You can freaking sit right here and do everything. Gator's a top quality vehicle. That's why. Well, you don't, don't, yeah, don't pay attention to the, don't pay attention to the, the, the frame right now. <laughs> Made it up to Dad's house, and uh, we went through the tolls. We didn't have any money, and I didn't, I've never experienced that in my life. It's a pain. They gotta write down your license. You got. They gotta take your license itself, and then there's probably like a, you know a service fee on top of that. And to top it all off, we were on a motorcycle, so it was it was even more convenient. I'm not complaining. The person or the two or three people behind me were definitely screaming. Did that person like scream behind us for a second? Didn't they say something? Yeah, I don't know. They did say something though. I heard some sarcasm. What are you doing with that? I don't know yet. Dad, what do you got for us? So yeah, Cole and I screwed up with the toll. He didn't have any money either. I, you, you gotta have cash. Cole, start carrying cash around, buddy. Can't afford to. <laughs> hey, listen here, Jack. Look around the bottom of the jack so it bends it out. The jack was hitting the back of the four wheeler, so now he's just gonna send it like this. How Cole lost his first tooth. That's why you gotta go around the bottom of the jack. <laughs> oh my God. What the hell are you guys up to? Is this Memorial Day or Labor Day? Cole and I just got back. He took off in his car. We made it with a motorcycle. We asked my dad for a small loan of $1.25 for the tolls this time. Yeah, processing fee of, I guess, $2. New York State is a joke. Q&A time. At the present time, I'm only uploading on Tuesdays, as you guys know, I upload, I try to upload at 8 p.m., but sometimes I put it up at five, sometimes I put it up much earlier than that for your viewing convenience. The number one question right now is like, what's going on and I will elaborate a little bit uh, right now this is not the original garage this isn't my mother's house and this isn't the shop that I was renting after my mother's house this is my own house I actually bought a house I this for sure I finally put on my big boy pants got my own place got a garage with like a concrete pad concrete driveway uh, it's not the it's not a mansion it's not nothing fancy that's not who I am uh, but I am like really handy so I'm going to make it my own the previous owner gave me the keys a day early now we're going after some locks I've tried out all the knobs I'm going with this one don't touch my knob ready to install some locks Keep everybody out. The high tech, wait, I saw it somewhere here. The high tech three pick resistant pins. I'm sure a lot of people already assume that, but yes, I have my own place. 
Uh, I really wasn't picky at all. I just needed a garage with a concrete pad. We have that. I needed a concrete driveway and I needed something that I could have uh, an office and uh, a bedroom. That's about it. Not nothing too picky. And this is my first house. We're at the house now. I don't think we have a time for the tour. We'll just unload some stuff and like maybe get one lock and then we gotta go. We had a slight dilemma with the move-in process. Two things, kind of sketchy. Now I'm at the courthouse right there. We're gonna go buy a house, I guess. Wish me luck. Watch the truck. Don't let us get any tickets. Maybe this time we'll come up with a lock system that has keys. This one doesn't have keys. I bought this like 30 minutes ago okay. and I put them in the house and there's no keys in there. Okay. You want to just return them? Yeah. Alright. Then I'll go pick out something different and I'll make sure that it has keys because we need the keys. It might be taboo for you guys, but I actually appreciate a smaller garage than a larger garage. I just feel so much more efficient. Not walking a mile everywhere. I have to clean up one mess in order to make another, which cuts down on cleanup and uh, expansion of projects that don't get finished. If you just stick to one, you finish it, then you clean it up, you get to the next one, things actually get done. Yes, this week, this thing was kind of pushed off. Sorry, sorry, gear. The reason why we didn't touch the gator this week is because I strictly focused all my time on the house. I finally just moved in like two days ago. I think last night was my last night spending the night and I've owned the house for about a month now, maybe a month and a half. All right, so this is the living room area. Uh, so currently don't have a deadbolt in there because you know our current situation, no keys, but we did get those replaced. Living area, show up. Show up. Oh yeah, got a nice new desk. Bathroom. Thinking this is gonna be the office to make the YouTube entertainment for you machine freaks. Oh, they left the lights on, great. <laughs> Good thing the electric's still in their name. <laughs> it's got a relatively big attic. I think we should edit that out. <laughs> then we got the basement. I like the fact that I'm not gonna hit my head on that. Look at all the room for activities. Do a little benching. You got your water heater. You got this thing. Is that concrete? Concrete sink? Wow. That's nice. We got a table that was purchased at Sears in 1936. I, I kind of get like a pool table vibe right here. And here's the most beautiful kitchen in the world. I love this yellow. It reminds me of, you know, getting on the school bus every day. Crush orange. It actually looks better on camera. This thing came with the table downstairs. Buy one, get one free. They're running a, a sale. Welcome home. It's a ghetto. Really? <laughs> Better lock the <laughs> up. <laughs> oh, man. You don't like it? I, I thought it was a nice area. I actually live in the city right now. I, I know it may not make a lot of sense, but I wanted to move out here to build like a network and, and just change something, do something different. I'm used to a population of 2,500. Here, there's a quarter of a million people, and I can do everything that I want to do, and then go take it 30 minutes down the road to my buddies, or like 50 minutes down the road to my grandmother's, and we can still tear it up. That's what we're gonna do with all this stuff. So we're gonna we're gonna continue with awesome reptastic content. We just been remodeling. <laughs> Don't need to buy weight switches anymore. Dollar saved is a dollar earned. I'm still in between my mother's house and this house. Uh, I'm actually going to spend the night at my mother's house tonight, so it's it's crazy. So like everybody is wondering why I'm only uploading once a week, and that's because I have to get all my eggs situated, all my ducks in a row before I just start firing. Because if I start doing, if I get out of, I don't want to get out of hand. How's that? This time around on 3D machines, I want things to go efficiently, and I want them to go right, and I want to uh, serve. Um, and deliver on my promises. This video is just basically to bring you up to speed and to get the elephant and to talk about the elephant in the room. Uh, mortgages, that's a new thing. I've never paid a mortgage. Now I'm, you know, this thing comes in the mail every month. You gotta pay for it. It's a lot of money. You live with your parents for a long time. That's what I did. I, I am kind of missing it. Stay froggy fresh, stay super fly. I have a house. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. Until next time, stay froggy fresh, stay super fly. 3D Machines out.
Oh yeah, and my motorcycle. You guys haven't seen that yet, but that'll be another upload. We can't let all the beans out of the basket just yet. Just finishing up the first, well we finished two rooms, but this is gonna be my office. It's looking good.